Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. And today's tutorial is about my routine for dry skin. If you have dry skin, this is a very good tutorial to watch because I'm gonna be telling you and showing you all the products that I use and what I do when I have dry skin. You know, this is to keep your skin moisturized. That's the most important thing that you want for dry skin is to keep your skin moisturized um, and not so dried out. So if you wanna know the products I use in my routine, keep watching. So all I did was moisturize my face with this and then for primers, okay, this is the ALF's Hydrating Face Primer. Hydrating? Did I just say hydrating? Oh my god. Hydrating Face Primer and this is what it looks like. Now, okay, here's my 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 thing with this. So it's like oily, you know, it's, it's oily. I'm going to do it on the back of my hand and you're going to see how oily it is. Can you see that shine right there? Now me personally, when I do my primers, I always put them on and then I go do something so that they dry. I'm not gonna throw this on two seconds later, throw this on three seconds later, throw my foundation on. That's so dumb. All I'm doing is mixing all the fucking products together and that just makes no fucking sense. So no, I like everything to dry, then layer, dry, layer, it's almost like painting. Basically, that's exactly what it is. So I already put um, this moisturizer on and I did my hair. So it's a little bit shiny, but not too much. It's like not even like it's it's good already. Alrighty, so all I did was zoom you guys in closer. Now, all I'm going to be doing is getting my foundation. That's all I'm going to be doing. I'm actually going in with the Milani foundation, but I mixed... Um, one and three and four and yeah i mixed a whole bunch of them so i'm just gonna be going in with my foundation and we're good Alrighty, so my foundation's already on now all i'm going to be doing is going in with my morph um 9fw foundation palette now I love this palette to contour with. I know they have a contour palette, but I really, really like this one. I don't know why, but I really do. So all I'm gonna be doing is going in like with my contour. Everything's gonna be like creamy today. Alrighty, now all we're gonna do is blend this out, of course. Cause we're not gonna walk around like that and I kind of do it backwards I know a lot of people like uh, highlight first um, with their concealer and stuff but I actually like to do the dark stuff first and then add on my um, concealer because then I can just blend it. I can I use like my concealer on this side then this side. So if I need to blend, I just switch the beauty blender around. As far as my nose, I'm still just getting that cream. And I'm going to be... Now all I'm going to be doing is going in with my concealer. Oh. I'm itchy. I'm just going in with a tart uh, Shape Tape, right? Yep. in and I'll just like blend them blend them in one they're gonna be blended I like that movie it's so cute okay so just like that righty so now all we're gonna be doing is going under our eye what we're doing is getting some um RCMA no color powder my setting powder it's amazing and I'm just going to set my under eye and just the corner of my nose because I am very I have powder everywhere I am very oily in my nose 
So I will set that. What I'm but doing is sweeping away this powder. Just wipe it away. So now, blush. Now I do not have a cream blush, but I do have some Milani pink lipsticks. Okay, and I have number 27, 11, and 17. Now all I did was, this one right here does not count. This was my cream contour. All I did was put them on the back of my hands, okay? Now all I'm gonna be doing is getting my finger and I'm going to be dipping into the lighter one. And the lighter one was number 27. Um, so I'm going to be dipping my finger into that real lightly, okay? I'm just tapping on the back of my hand any extra um, lipstick that I don't want. And I'm just going to kind of go in. And it smells amazing. So... I don't know if you guys can see it's very very light now I'm gonna do the same thing again and then I'm going to tap it on the back of my hand and then this is how my fingers looking and then I'm just going to I'm gonna use another finger just to take some off I actually did not dip into this color at all I'm only going into these two colors right here and this light one and then I'm just tapping down the back of my hand again and I'm gonna go in so just know like you can make anything work with makeup that's the fun part about makeup is it's all just fun it's trying different things it's just messing around seeing what works seeing what doesn't work and uh this fucking lipstick works and it's creamy it's not matte so they're all cream so there we go now I got my blush on okay now if you feel like you put too much just get other fingers and go like that and kind of take some off but I think I'm um I think I'm good alrighty now all I'm gonna be doing is taking some cream highlighter and this is the Becca cream highlighter um and opal now I'm just going to rub it on the back of my hands like that. Okay, and I'm just going to swirl it around like that and just kind of tap it. Now you can use your fingers, but I'm actually gonna go in with the brush. And I'm just going in with this Morphe brush right here. And I'm just gonna go like that. And then I'm just going to It's just like a dewy, you know, it's not like extreme crazy highlight. It's just like a nice compared to this side where there's nothing. And then here. And like that. Okay, see that made like a big difference. Just like that. So we got our contour we got our blush we got our highlight now if you want to be dramatic and make this um this right here more sharp all you would do was would be um getting your concealer and today is my niece's birthday she turns one i cannot wait to see her right now she's at the doctor because she doesn't feel good my poor little fat baby So I'm like trying to hurry up and get ready and this way I'm ready when she comes home. Yeah. Now I'm just going to be going in with this Milani Brilliant Shine Lip Gloss. I love Milani products. Alright, so now that our lips are on, now the final step of course is to set it. Um, I have my fan right here and we're just going to... Set it. 
Alrighty, so that is the end of the video. I hope you guys liked it. I hope it was helpful. Um, please don't forget to like, comment, let me know what you guys think. Don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Instagram at Fatty Glams.